Good morning. I am heading to Coventry Pool Meadow Coach Station, ready to catch a bus to Heathrow Terminal 5, because today I am flying to San Diego. I don't know about you guys, but before I get on a flight, I am a ball of nervous energy. So I'm just waiting for my coach at the coach station now, and then I will be heading to Heathrow. just arrived at Heathrow Airport Terminal 5 so I am heading to the departures area and I'm gonna go meet my little sister everybody say hello this is Lola Hi. we are going to San Diego together we're gonna to go visit our dad who lives in Fulbrook we've picked up our essential pre-flight stuff I've got a bottle of apple juice and some sweets Lola has got some Fanta and some sweets yeah and we are heading to gate B37 for 11 and a half hours worth of flight time. I've arrived at my new home for the next 11 and a half hours. <laughs> Me and Lola aren't sitting together because we booked at different times. You may use handheld devices such as mobile phones, tablets and e-readers during takeoff and landing. About three hours into the flight, we just had a nice uh, dinner of nice curry, chicken makami. I watched um, Ghost in the Shell, which I wanted to see for ages, and it was really good. And now I'm just watching La La Land. Um, appropriate, because I'm on the way to California. <laughs> Eleven and a half hours later, and I've now landed. I am exhausted. I've had probably about one hour sleep total. Um, but it's about seven o'clock in the evening here, so not long till I can go to sleep for the night. Wake up nice and jet lagged tomorrow. Good morning. I have not been awake that long. Um, I managed to sleep through the night. Woke up about six o'clock this morning, so I got a good six hours rest, I'd say, um, after all of that traveling yesterday. I didn't end the vlog yesterday because I was gonna do a house tour, but I was too tired and it was too dark. So I'm gonna take you on a tour of the house today and show you what's going on. I've now, I've walked up the drive so I can do like the proper full on as if I've just come to the house tour to show you how beautiful this place is. Welcome to MTV Cribs. Let me show you around. Come through. So as you walk in through the front door, this is what you're greeted with, this massively grand hallway with super high ceilings and it's sloped and curved. Through to our left, we have the lounge dining area. The kitchen. Americans and their fridges. Look at the size of this. This is a double, look at that. You would not find a fridge that size in the UK. Washers and dryers, they're so much bigger here. They do it on like an industrial scale. Look at this. Everything is so much bigger in America. And if you'll follow me through the grand hallway once more, we will show you the guest bathroom. Little WC moment. <laughs> in here we have the master bedroom, which is very glam. And this is the master ensuite um, with a dressing area, separate little toilet moment, two sinks, kind of walk-in shower thing, and a jacuzzi <laughs> bath. So something else that uh, is really common in American homes, but not in English homes, is like a walk-in wardrobe. It's like part of the house. 
houses in general here are much bigger and real estate is much cheaper and everything is just on a larger scale so for an English person it's uh, pretty crazy. Next we're gonna show Lola's room which is probably already made a tip. Complete with <laughs> sweets and chocolate. Very naughty. So Lola's got a TV. She's got a nice slidey mirror wardrobe. Hi again. Woo. Oh, hey there. I've just had a shit. Oh wow, this is really oh, cool. It's really nice. This is the space that my dad is using as his office. It's pretty cool. It's like a converted garage. There's lots of light. This is the room that I am in. Woo! She did a graduate. And I will take you through to my bathroom. I have got a lovely um, kind of walk-in shower. We've had such a horrible summer in England this year, so to come out here and it just be pure blue skies, glorious sunshine, and this is the weather that they get every single day here. Why anyone would live in England by choice, I do not know. An outdoor kitchen, I think. There's loads of different um, fruit trees on the grounds here. So these are actually grapefruits and they're all ripe and ready to eat. I'm told they're really, really sweet, but I don't actually like grapefruits, so I'm not gonna have one. While I'm taking you on this tour, I just want to be super clear. I'm not doing this to show off, I'm not doing this to brag. I'm actually unemployed and don't have a house. I'm back at my mum's house in Coventry. But I feel like it would be uh, wrong of me to, you know, go on this trip, vlog it and not show the house because uh, I didn't want to give the wrong impression of myself. But it's a lovely house. I'm very lucky to be staying here. I'm very fortunate to be in California in the first place. Um, but I don't want you guys to feel like I'm bragging or showing off because that just isn't the case at all. So guys, that concludes the tour. I hope you enjoyed this video. I am out of breath for those stairs. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. You can also find me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, wherever. I am all over the place. I will see you again soon. Goodbye.